in today's video, I will show you step by step how to use the Yelp API. If you go to the link here, you can see all of the information related to the Yelp API. And for this tutorial, I'll be going through some of these APIs that you see listed here. And this is what the final result will look like. Once I make the API call, and this one specifically, we get all of the restaurants in New York City. You can see I get back all the data here. So to start this process, the first thing you need to do is to make a Yelp account. Once you made a Yelp account, just click on this link that says create app. Now we will create our own API key to test various Yelp API calls. So now we just need to fill out a basic form. So for the app name, I'll just do test. Industry, you can select whichever one you would like. Just put down your email, put down description, and just make sure that the first box is checked here. And just select this last box that says I'm not a robot. And then click on create new app. And once it's successfully created, you can now see that the API key has been generated for you. Now we can just copy this API key. And now I will switch over to the documentation that will explain the first API call I'm going to make. And this one specifically is the business search Yelp API. The easiest way to get started with this specific API call is just to copy this URL here and switch to Postman and make sure to paste it here. And the next change I need to make is to add a query param. And this specific key would just be location. And the value can be whatever city you would like. I'm just going to do NYC in this example. And one last change I need to make is to go to the authorization tab. And for the type, just click on bear token if it's not already selected. And just make sure to paste in the API key that we copied earlier. Once you've completed all these steps, just hit send up here. And you should now see all of the restaurants that are located in the New York City area. If you want to know what other query parameters this Yelp API takes, if we go back to documentation, we can see that there are a bunch of different parameters that you can use in order to like fine tune your search. One of these is categories, as you see here. So if you want to get more specific in your search query, we could add this categories query parameter and look for specific categories of restaurants in New York City. If we scroll down a little bit more, we can see there's also other query parameters, such as like the price, as well as like if the restaurant's open now or not. Now I will switch to Postman to show you another API call using these additional query parameters. So as you see here, this is very similar to our previous API call, except now we're using the categories and price query parameter. And for the category, I'm just doing Chinese food. And for the price, I'm just doing one, which stands for like $1 sign for that specific restaurant. And now we just hit send. And the Yelp API returns all of the data back that meets this criteria that we put here. For the next API example, I'll be showing you how to display restaurants that offer delivery as an option. Just copy the URL to have here and make sure the location is the city that you want to search for and then just hit send. Here we can see this is a list of all restaurants in New York City that do delivery as an option. For the next API example, I'll be showing you how to get more information about a specific restaurant. If we look back at the previous API call that we made, let's just say, for example, this restaurant here, we can see that there's an ID field. If we just copy this ID and paste it into the specific URL here, this specific Yelp API call will be able to get us more information about this specific restaurant. And so if we just hit send, we can now see additional information about this restaurant, such as photos, as well as their hours. And for the very last API example, I will show you how to look at reviews for a specific restaurant. And this API call is very similar to the previous API call. Just make sure to copy this URL that you see here and make sure to update the Yelp ID. Once you have the correct Yelp ID, just hit send. And we can now see the three Yelp reviews here. And that's the end of this Yelp API tutorial. Hopefully you found this video helpful and educational. If you did, please like the video and don't forget to subscribe for more content.